pants for David. Melt's chief Matt Fish made his chef, but chief chef. He's the founder of the doggone place. He made his mark with overstuffed grilled cheese sandwiches. In tonight's Cleveland Cooks, he's showing Jen Pichana how to eat, construct, and eat those giant things. tells me he is the evil mastermind behind Melt. He is a gourmet grilled cheese guru, Chef Matt Fish. Thank you, thank you. He's gonna show us how to make his Cleveland-themed sandwich. Correct. The Parmageddon. The Parmageddon. I was trying to come up with a sandwich that was very Cleveland-centric. Sure. But come on, pierogies. It I doesn't mean, get more Cleveland than that. more Cleveland than that. Any pierogi will do. We use a, a potato and onion pierogi, okay. but you can use, really, the sky is the limit. You can use a potato and cheese, you can use a sauerkraut and cheese, you can use sauerkraut and potato. If you want, the crazier the better. All right, so we start with the bread. We use a kind of a hybrid loaf. It's somewhere between a French and an Italian. Any bread will do. If you're making a grilled cheese sandwich at home, I would just highly suggest using your favorite bread. We put margarine on both sides. All right. And go ahead, drop it down. Mm -hmm. This is a non-stick flat top roller, which is what we use. While the bread is toasting, we're going to go over to our stove top. We've got a saute pan getting hot right here. We're going to make right. our pierogi mixture. Mm -hmm. We're going to grab our vegetable oil. We're going to put about one to one and a half ounces in. All right, we've got our pierogies here, our fresh pierogies. We're going to add those, what we call ribbon side down. It's going to be the top down. So we're going to brown the top first, and then right. we're going to flip it over. So we're going to add our Napa cabbage. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Angry cabbage. And then we've got some sauteed onions right here. All right. We're going to put those in there. That's our kraut spice. All right. It's a mixture of brown sugar, salt, pepper, cinnamon, cardamom. Um, and the, the, the key ingredient in there is caraway seeds. Caraway seeds. Caraway seeds. It's kind of like a like a like a brining liquid. All right. So if I, you can add about give me like about two little pinches of it in there. So, so what we've got here is this is uh, 40 proof vodka and apple cider vinegar. So we're gonna put about one cup. All right. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna reduce this down. Yeah. You may. <laughs> Thank you. So what this is is really is we're making a quick sauerkraut. And we brought out our sharp cheddar cheese. Provolone would be great on here. There's no rules to what we're doing. We're making grilled cheese sandwiches. We're not reinventing, you know, we're not changing the world here. <laughs> and really to build the stability of this, of this bread, you want to toast it on both sides. You've got to hold up to all this stuff. You've got to hold up to all this awesomeness there. that we're putting on there. What I'm gonna have you do is put each pierogi right here. All right. Put one pierogi, two pierogi. All okay. right. We're gonna take the rest of our mixture, which is our Napa vodka kraut. Mm. We're gonna put that on the opposite side. We put an oven between 300 and 400 degrees. We've already cooked everything on here. All we're doing is melting the cheese, and we're going to kind of melt everything together. Make everything hang out for Make a while. Make everything happy, happy, happy. So we're going to be taking our completed sandwich out of the oven. Mm. It's been in there for about three and a half minutes, so it's got a nice toast and a nice melt on it. And we're going to plate it like this. It smells really good. Yeah, the pierogi sandwich is as big as my head. <laughs> we suggest you dive right in okay. and go for it. So it's, a, it's definitely a two-handed sandwich. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to indulge with you here. All right, here goes. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Cleveland. I taste Cleveland. Cleveland in your mouth. <laughs> I'm glad I skipped lunch. I'm in. Bring a friend. Wow. Is your mouth watering? Before you eat it, snap it and send it. Cleveland Cooks is giving away cookbooks. Just take a picture of a dish you want Jen to, fe to feature in the future. Post it and use the hashtag CLE Cooks. Now your Night Action News first alert forecast with Jeff Tanchek.